Speedcar here, and today I want to do another computer build thing, and I'm sorry that I just recorded one, but uh, it's been a while since I recorded, and my computer's dying, and I haven't been able to, and I just recorded, at least attempted to record two other things, and people have said I was moving around a lot next last video, and sorry, but I did get my motherboard in and stuff power supply and I did get better lighting I moved it in the kitchen see power power and other stuff oh god coming out and I don't know where most of this stuff goes because my motherboard does not really say just most of its fans see channel where is it in the video channel fan 2 then CPU fan then you got one fan down here and you know other stuff. I need to look at the case, um, the case out, the case booklet because the motherboard's not really designed for all this stuff. Because mainly most of it is, you know, the front over here. Then nah, what else? Yeah, my motherboard. See, this is where the processor goes. I don't have my processor, so it's just sitting there. If I flip it open. Yeah, just where my processor goes right there. Get it back real quick. Give me a second. Nothing like editing will fix that, so. Then, there's a start and reset button. Then, you know, my RAM stick right here. 16. That's good for processing my videos. And, sound. It says, Supreme FX, which is sound. And I would think my audio would go near it, but it doesn't go anywhere near it. The Republic of the Gamers. And it does come with a lot of other stuff, but not really necessary to show. And, well, there's not much to this, but this is kind of a little saying I'm not dead. You know, people, how all these go over the edge with that. I'm going to start, you know, recording, you know, spring break. I was out of town. Can't do crap. And back to the computer, you know, these are like real cold, like cold rocks, I guess. You know, it cool might help cool my CPU. There's not much else to it except, you know, all these little prongs for this stuff. And next, I'm probably going to order my processor or a disk, disk drive or some hard drives put in it for now. But, you know, it all got to get added up to it until you know it's fully done on its side right now and this thing is really hard to put together because of these little extra not really necessary crap because you got a little one prong out know, there a little two and little extra crap in here where is it yeah there's a little two again what where's my where's my one prong um yeah here they are See a little double one, and it's all these is literally, those literally just go to the LED lights up here. You know, little LED lights. So, I don't know how I'm going to get that done. Then my back again, power, and oh, show the back of my CPU. See, I don't know if you can see what, you know, old mouse, HDMI, video, SS, um, USB 3 then another ethernet down here. I wish I could have a flashlight on my phone while I record but I can't Which kind of sucks then the power again But I don't really know what to say until I get my all my other stuff I'm gonna pop out one of the RAM real quick Pop it right out Here it's a G scale rip jaw So it will focus or what it says, you know, eight times two. It's in, it says Intel ready on it, so this is made for Intel. So that's good because I am building a Intel computer like thing. Put that in. Whoa. Wait a second, because you just kind of pop it in. Wait till you hear all of them. Push it down and click it. Push it down again. And this motherboard was hard to put in because 
like I said, and I, I don't know if I told anyone my thing in my subscribers, but it did not come with screws. But luckily, I did get screws from my case because that would have been real bad. But you had to push it on really hard and not too hard to make it break, but not too soft for it to rattle around while you're moving it. You know. Oh, that's where it just holds. So there's a little cover. So it won't mess up anything. Put it back on. Okay, I did about just break it, but I was able to get it. You know, battery. I don't know why, but when my old Vista computer broke, I changed the battery and it worked. Even though the battery does nothing. And there's my fan, 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 oh, fan. Okay, nothing else to show. Could put a fan out here. My, my going to put a fan up here. Will and my CPU fan, the you know cool processor. It is going to be a thermal take. See it right there. It is going to be thermal take. And the Maximus set seven here, but and it does have customized BIOS, like I probably said. And I can't remember what I said because I'm just kind of going what going where I go. Just letting what falls out of my mouth goes because I can't really talk that well. But I am getting better. So here's a little update video. I am going to come out with a Minecraft video tomorrow. So that will be, you know, whenever. Probably because today's Thursday and tomorrow's Friday, which is when I'm going to be uploaded. So probably Sunday. I can't really keep track, but I am going to be doing it by then. And I'm trying to think what else I need from a computer CPU, processor, optical drive, hard drive, hard drive, hard drive. What else? That's really it. A Windows 8.1, Intel, opt uh, Intel Wireless. Yeah, that's it then. And I gotta do cable management. Oh god. Well, there goes my power right there. I'll fix that later, but. Yeah, guys, this is a speed carter, and this is my computer that I am slowly breaking and building, I guess. So, this speed carter here, and I'll see you later, whenever, or tomorrow, if I get around to it. Bye.